Hey YouTubers, today I've got a really special saw here to show you. Right behind here is a 1959 steel Contra or Lightning. It's 106 cc's, one of the early one-man chainsaws. And this saw here is in mint condition. It's been painted, but the collector who owns it is very meticulous and really looks after his stuff and he's kept it in pristine condition. So I'll give you a brief overview of the saw. And after that, I've got a friend coming over and we're going to try it out in some nice lumber outside. Nice big bar on there. And here's Mr. Still, Andrea Still, in a picture with that same saw. Company founder Andrea Still, born 1896, with the legendary Still Contra chainsaw. This gearless machine with centrifugal clutch, a six horsepower engine, and a weight of 12 kilograms started the worldwide breakthrough of the chainsaw at the end of the 1950s. So this was a really innovative saw for the day. This one here says lightning on them and other saws I believe in Europe say contra on them but it's the same chainsaw. Here's the fuel tank, oil tank, oil override. Apparently it oils itself but you can override it here by pushing down on it while you're cutting to manually pump oil to the bar. My friend had this in some competitions and he's really good at sharpening his chains. They're like razor sharp, literally. It's unbelievable. I think he puts over 20 hours just to sharpen a chain. Here's the tag on the saw. Gives you the type and motor number. Now if I flip the saw over just to show you underneath. Even though it's been painted, it wasn't really abused before that. So it's in excellent condition. There's a the clutch on that, it's brand new. And it's even got an eyeglass here for the oil level for the chain. It's got a brand new bar on there. Doesn't have a roller at the end though, that's how they were made. And this is an OEM steel bar for this chainsaw. If I remember correctly, he told me he bought this bar from a dealer who had leftover stock from the 50s and he paid 250 bucks for it. Now here's the spark arrestor for the muffler. Sometimes he runs it without the spark arrestor. So I'm going to take the cover off and show you what kind of carbs under there. Sometimes you got to push in this button to do that. Take the cover off. Here we've got a Tillotson carburetor, model HL112C. You can still get carb kits for these. So I'm just gonna put it back together, then we're gonna try it out. So I got my friend here, he's gonna try it out. We're gonna start it up. Good? Yeah. It's for a collector. It's a saw you just kind of store on the shelf, I guess. So it's a pretty nice saw. Cuts real good. It's pretty heavy. So it'd be a good saw for the collector out there. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you in my next video.